There is a large old-fashioned maze which presents an undertone of danger to the audience. It additionally indicates that the hotel this family are staying in is also very old-fashioned. Old Locations like these are very commonly used in horror films. Dark lighting and multiple shadows amplifies and foreshadows potential danger. Props such as knives and an axe used as weapons shows signs of serious danger and therefore leaves the audience in fear. Jack's frozen, emotionless facial expression and body language when sitting here in the snow leads the audience to feel sympathetic towards him. It is clear that being in continuous solitary has made him cold-hearted and emotionless. An old photograph is shown to the audience. The photo is of Jack. This caused a large amount of confusion among the audience. This bird's eye view of these two characters in the maze emphasises just how large the maze is. It additionally amplifies their vulnerability and lack of power as characters in the maze. A tracking shot is displayed of Jack being dragged along the floor. A high angle shot is also seen of Jack. This exaggerates his lack of power and vulnerability. There is a second perspective shot which is seen from Danny's point of view. Here Danny is running away from his father. This shot is panicked and cautious, amplifying his fear of getting caught. Parallel editing of Danny screaming and Jack cutting someone with an axe shows that Danny knew that Jack was going to do this, revealing to the audience that Danny has some sort of supernatural power. Here is a series of quick cuts going back and forth between the girls alive and dead. This terrifies and confuses the audience. Fast-paced editing when Danny is running through the maze from Jack puts the audience on edge and makes them fear for Danny. situation as soon as I get out of here. Will you indeed, Mr. Torrance? I wonder. I have my doubts. I and others 